Ladies and gentlemen, if you haven't already, please click the subscribe button. And if you're feeling extra crazy, drop a like and turn those notifications on. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Eto's Excellence. Today is episode 90. Just 10 more episodes until we go ahead and get ourselves the 92 rated Sammy Eto that is on the transfer market. Let's actually have a look. How much is he coming in at these days? He's coming, oh, that was a 5.5 there, 5.1. Uh, I think he's 3.3 these days. Should we have a quick look, shall we? So 3.3, wait, is that 3 million? Yeah, it is. 3.3, there we go, see how many we got under there. So he's going to be around 3.3 million coins. And when we sell our Sammy Eto, who actually I don't know how much our Eto is worth at the moment. I think he's gone down by like a million since I bought him. I bought him for 2.7, so he's just under 2 million coins. So we should just about have enough coins for Sammy Eto in 10 episodes time, which is amazing. And also, I have uh, gutted the club. None of the players in my team are currently tradable because obviously team of the year, the price crashed on the market right now is currently in the bin this is my silver stars team which i've just completed to get uh, the german player who we're going to be unlocking in today's episode a uh, romarino by the way if you have if you never did the silver stars romarino you missed out because he is bloody good anyways in the first team of the eto's excellent this is the team we are currently using this is the team i prefer the 442 of Henri on the left robin on the right i do mix it up every now and again bring in bruno mctominay is going to get a plus one increase because obviously United drew 0-0 to Liverpool but yeah the only players that are tradable in this team is Eto and Allison, which I think is an absolute dub royale look at all these players I've got they are all actually pretty sure Loz Lozano is tradable isn't it yeah Lozano is tradable but he's a first owner and he's an absolute beast so we're keeping him now I was hoping today's episode was going to be team of the year but alas, Team of the Year is not out, so we're not going to have that. But I have made some packs and some player picks to do in today's episode. Uh, but first up, let's get ourselves the Ondrich or Andrich, who actually does link into my Silver Stars team. So getting him is, was very useful. He, he is slow, but if you slap a, a shadow on him, he'll do absolute wonders for me in the midfield of my Silver Stars team. And FC Unian, I've actually seen play before live so there you go a little fact about me and i think to kick things off uh we've got this ondrich guy here we've got five player picks now obviously in the past my player picks have been very very lucky uh they were stinky and now they became good so hopefully we can continue the form off obviously five um i don't know if headliners are still in packs or not i'm unsure i don't think they are but I guess we'll find out on these five player picks. Go on. I tell you what, 85 rated Koke in the first one. Double decent. In the second one, can we match a Koke? Oh, Paulista. We'll take a Paulista, 80, 82 rated. Number three. Number three. I'll take a Telisco, 82 rated. You'll have to see it. The fourth one, the penultimate one of these player picks. Hello. A Julian Brand, 84. I tell you what, these are decent. We got two... 84 and an 85, decent fodder. And the final one, Robin Promes or 83 Trap. We'll take the Trap, highest rated. But is he a duplicate untradeable or is the other guy tradable? Let's find out. Oh, look at that. You love to see it. Tradable. So that was actually not bad. 84 rated fodder card for SBCs and an 85 Koke who links. has a lot of links for him. So there you go. And obviously the Ondrich Silver Stars. Also over on Season Progress, we are up to level 20. We get a rare Electrum Players Pack. Now... The smart ones would be saving their packs for Team of the Year, but I'm not because I'm an idiot. And I know we're going to be putting on FIFA points for Team of the Year because why not? Anyways, we've got 13 packs. What I've done, I've gone into SBCs, the League SBCs, and found out which are the best packs in terms of value and what you get back. Uh, I think off the top of my head, you've got the Liverpool one. The Bayern Munich one. The Brazil in the Libertadores one. And I believe there's one more. You get like uh, Prime player packs, prime goal packs. I basically did the ones where you get the most players from. So there you go. We've also got a single draft token pack from one of the headliners challenge. Wow. That's actually quite, quite fun. Before I forget, I believe there's one more SBC we need to do, which I've pre-made. So let's go over to the favorites. There you go, the FGS challenge. This was for, oh no, we're missing, we're missing a player from either one of the Lazio, Florentina, Udinese or Parma. Right, let's see if I've got one in the club. Oh no, this isn't good. I think I'm missing a Florentina. Where are you, Syria? Let's have a look. Do we have one? Do we have one from one of these clubs? Lazio, Lazio. We need someone, Lazio. We need someone who's actually going to give me chemistry though. That's the issue. We'll just convert him to a centre mid and that should give us the chemistry, I think. So Cam, actually that might even do it right there. 
Does that give us 85 chemistry? Yes, it has. Perfect. And we got ourselves a small, rare gold players pack. So let's go into the store and open the 13 packs. I think we've got some stinky ones of these golds and premium gold packs. So we'll quickly rush through these. And then we've got like prime, uh, some good player packs, some really good player packs. So fingers crossed we can pack someone good in the first gold pack. Nothing. In the first premium gold player pack, we also get nothing. And surprise, surprise, in the second premium gold pack. Again, we get nothing. And then I think we've got a jumbo premium gold pack next. So let's quick sell. Oh, we keep Vargas. Oh, La Celso is actually not the worst. We'll shove him up in the transfer market. Then we move over to... Did I just speak English there? Then we move over to the jumbo premium gold pack. 24 gold, 7 rares. Don't know how many players. We'll find out in this one. Oh. No board. No walkout. Nothing. And then we're going to be up with these premium gold player packs. Primary gold player packs. And also rare election. So we'll start with the rare get the megas and we'll work from the back to the best so in the election pack go on oh oh a little Libertadores player which means there could be something decent behind him go on go on a little Mbappe tradable no there isn't but there is Yuri Burchi 83 rated and then oh wisdom we next up have a mega pack and then another mega pack and then a small rare gold player pack if it loads it's finally loaded in here we go then here we go in the mega the Mega Royale. No board. No walkout. Is it going to be anyone of semi-decency? Ferran Torres. You know, Premier League players are decent these days for SBCs. And double, double Premier League keepers. And then we do have that second Mega Pack. Come on. Come on. I would like one walkout from these. These are decent packs I'm opening in today's episode. And yet, nothing's really happening for us. To be fair, we haven't opened uh, the proper good ones. We're only opening... The weaker ones at the moment. I would I would like something of some decency, as I said, in these packs to come out of these. And then we've got a small rare gold player pack. Six players, all rare, with at least five gold players in it. Go on then. I finally, we got our first board. Here we go. We get ourselves a German board. Set a mid. It's Gundogan. Gundogan. He scored an absolutely fantastic goal against... Who was it? Crystal Palace? Here we go then. Five left. We've got three prime gold player packs and two premium gold player packs. So these, as I said, these are decent packs to be opening. Let's see if we can get anything though in the prime. No board. No walkout. It's going to be right back. Sacco. I mean, he's a good player, but not worth anything. The second premium gold player pack then. Go on then. Go on then. I'll take a, I'll take a, I'll take a Neymar. Go on then. One Neymar coming right up. Again, no walkout, no board. It's not what we want to be seeing, ladies and gentlemen. It's not at all. Who do we get? We get ourselves. Javi Martinez. You know what? That was not good. My disappointment is immeasurable. I have high hopes on these three. Three prime gold player packs from the league SBCs. Come on. Come on. We've got to get at least one walkout from these packs. We've got to. Please. A board. We'll take a board. Uruguay. Set it back, Godin. 85. 85 rated fodder. That's exactly what I want to be seeing. There you go. If you're not going to get a walkout, the base you can ask for is a 85 rated board. And Bruno Perez. The penultimate pack of the episode. The second prime gold players pack. This is going to be our first walkout. No, it's not. Board. Yes, it is. There's no walkout, unfortunately. That's annoying. Austrian board. Set it back. David Alaba. 84 rated. Nice. The stats on him actually are genuinely really good. He, I think he'd make a great CDM. Though, do we have him in the club? I don't think so. I don't think he's a duplicate. Oh, he is. Please tell me my other Alaba is tradable. Please. No. Oh, that's annoying. And then the final prime gold players pack. Are we going to get a walkout from all of these? Surely one walkout. Surely. Surely. No. Oh. Informed board. Not a clue. Absolutely not a clue. Who is this? Taremi. It's an inform. It's a board. But it's not the walkout that I was after, unfortunately. Anyone else decent in the pack? No. I mean, I guess we'll, we, we always do need Team of the Weeks for SBCs. I feel like this week is very much so uh, just counting down the days to Team of the Year when everything's going to get kicked up, up a bit. We do have this mega matchup 
objectives. So play five rival matches, get a rare mega pack. Obviously, these you, you, they, they're introducing these, so you've got a few packs for team of the year. Um, we have Gwedes to work towards. We have Sinkraven to work towards. But I think what we're going to do is jump into a rival match and try and crack on with these rare mega pack objectives. As you can see there, also, uh, we're sat in rank two at the moment where we're going to finish. So, unfortunately... We're not going to get rank one. And oh wait, I haven't even told you. Oh my word, I haven't even told you. Oh, let me just let me just quickly tell you guys. This is big. This is big news. So there I am, Sunday night. I'm on 19 wins with five games to go. I need one win for gold one to secure the good packs. You know, get three wins and you get the extra player pick. As you can see, there's no extra player pick. I failed that. But did I get one win out of the last five games? No. No, I didn't. I lost all five. Ask me how angry I was. I was angry. Very angry. And disappointed in myself. But, alas, rank 2, goal 2 this week. Here we go then. And Oh, wow! Eusebio, Messi, Neymar and Mbappe. This is a juicy, juicy team. Here we go then. I have a feeling this game is going to be a tough one because everyone in Rivals right now is sweating for their much-needed wins. So let's see if my boys can do something about it. Come on. Oh, into Ronnie the Rocket. Into the through ball to Eto. He's turned Kunde. Oh, and he's absolutely finished it like a pudding on a dessert. That makes no sense, but we're one and up. Oh no, it's Eusebio on Vidic. Oh, Vidic, don't get turned. Mate, Eusebio is actually filth. Wow, the agility on that guy was outrageous. My friend, what are you doing with Neymar? Lad. He's finally passed it. I'm not sure what he was doing with Neymar there, but he's wasted time. I've got the ball back. And now we go and counter-attack. Go on, Eto. Into Robin. Yes, he doesn't think we're going to stay on his left foot. Oh, he's dead on the right foot. He whips it in. He's got me a corner. you love to see it. Right, let's play the short corner Royale. It's worked for me in the past. We'll do it again. Ready? Oh. Go on. Tavernier. Oh. Oh, wait, that should have gone in. That is so nice. That is so nice. That is the chemistry we're after. Mbappe may have tackled him earlier, but he's definitely just assisted him. And that is the chemistry we want in the Eto's Excellence. All right, we're going to make some half-time subs. Uh, what we're going to do is take off Thierry Henry. We are going to bring on... Who should we bring on? Should we bring on... We'll bring on Philippe Anderson, also Ronnie the Rocket. Uh, this team I'm playing against needs to have an agile midfielder, so we're going to bring on our wee -wai. just a bit more fluid in the mixer. Uh, and so far, Vidic is doing a good job. He's keeping up with the pace they've got up top, so we'll keep it like that for now. Oh! <laughs> that is why we keep Vidic on. Oh my goodness, the short corner into Eto, into Vidic with the touch of Burkamp and then knocks it round knocks it round him, scores a goal like that, wowzes, and then a clearance. He's a man of many traits. Go on, Robin. Okay. Eto. That is not a good pass. But Arawiwa is there. We're in. We're in. Go on, Eto. He's giving me room to breathe. Who cuts inside? Eto! It's a corner. It's a corner. What a challenge. Oh my word, Vidic. Vidic. Wowzers. Talk to me, Vidic. That's an outrageous challenge. Yes, Mbappe. Release Abawiwa. Not quite. Renato Sanchez is there. But, mate, let's talk about that. Vidic challenge again. Okay, he's definitely getting yellow carded. It's Mbappe. On Van Dijk. Oh, mate. You need to work on your ability in front of goal. Here we go. We're on the break. We're on the break. It's Eto bearing down on goal. He crosses it. Mbappé! That is four. And that is game over. Oh, yes. Eto! 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 Oh, it's in the ball. Mbappé! Oh, my word. How have I not scored that? How have I not scored? Here he comes. It's Messi. May I eat your players for breakfast. My defence is absolutely rock solid right now. Watch this, ready? He thinks we're going that way. No, because Eto is in. It's the man, the myth, the Eto. I think this man's head has completely 
and utterly gone. There is confirmation, Samieto got a hat-trick, Mbappe scored one. I, actually, before we continue and end this episode, um, because obviously I'm just, I want to get to Team of the Year as soon as possible. But before we continue, I just want to check out what's everyone's records looking like in terms of goals to game recently. So we need to head over to the Squad Royale. Mbappe, let's have a look at yours. You have scored 50 goals and played 38 games. Okay. That's pretty insane. And Eto has scored 330 goals in 282 games. Blimey. Henri, 89, 127. Decent. He paid up front for a bit. Probably where he got the majority of his goals. Kante, no. Ronaldinho, 27 and 67. Robin, 19 and 70. Hernandez, 0. Van Dijk, 16 and 200 games. Decent. Vidic, 6 and 77. Tavernier, 2 and 37. And Allison, none in 34. And actually, to top it all off, Son, 105 goals in 139 games. What a player. And actually, Awawiwa, what are you on? 50 and 126. Just a team of absolute goal-scoring machines. So as I said, we are only 10 episodes away from upgrading our Samuel Eto. Also, a part of me really wants to upgrade Vidic, but I don't know who we'd get. Like maybe a Rio Ferdinand to get that strong link to Tavernier. The only issue is, is that buying players right now is a no-go because you're going to lose so many coins on your players because the Team of the Year market crash is well and truly happening right now. I just need Team of the Year to come out as soon as possible or for them to release some cool you know, 86 plus SBCs, which I was really hoping they did today and they didn't. To end off the episode, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we're going to be opening this 281 plus player pack. Now, if you have enjoyed this episode, please be sure to drop a like, subscribe. I know recently we haven't been playing as many games, but that is because uh, we, we have no division rivals to play, basically, and we can do our friendly objectives. Uh, I'm going to be streaming a lot more very, very soon, so make sure you subscribe with my notifications turned on so you know exactly when I go live. But if you're excited for Team of the Year, let me know in the comments. And also, actually, you know what? Let's spark a debate. Let's put your own team of the years in the comments down below and i'll be replying to you lot but with that being said let's open this 281 plus pack uh, let's hope we get something good can we end on a walkout can this be a walkout it's not board at least it is a board who's it gonna be it's gonna be a spaniard right back carvajal 84 red as piloqueta that's actually double decent and then 284s in the same pack 284s in the same pack Hey, 83 Mandana, that's Blakota. That's decent photo I've just secured for the for the boys. Anyways, with that being said, see you all tomorrow. Bye bye.